Hey plant gang, white oak right now, Corcus alba. All oaks are in the same family, Fagaceae. Uh, this is a wide ranging family and there are different classifications of oak. So I am standing here in front of the queen of the white oak group. There's a group of Asian oaks, there's a group of red oaks, uh, but there is this very large group of white oaks. And the queen of that, like I said, is Corcus alba or the white oak. Uh, this is a very large tree uh, that's native to our woodlands uh, in East Tennessee, but throughout the eastern seaboard. So the white oak is a very interesting plant, again, uh, native to our woodlands throughout the eastern United States. Uh, here, of course, is the fruit of all oaks, which you, you probably know, uh, the acorn. You know, one thing I want you to notice about it, all members of the white oak group have rounded lobes. The edges of the leaves are round, and so uh, if it has pointy, pointy leaves, uh, then it definitely can't be a red oak. It uh, can't be a white oak because it's got uh, smoothed edge leaves. Uh, now this one in particular is very deeply lobed. Uh, the, the insertions inside of the leaf are, are quite deeply lobed. Uh, if you notice also lighter on the back side. Uh, now this oak is used uh, quite uh, extensively commercially for things like flooring and furniture building. Uh, it's also used by our wildlife like deer. Uh, they love to eat the acorns of white oak uh, and so it is also a very popular tree with our native wildlife. Corcus alba, the white oak, this tree gets 50 to 90 foot high, can spread out 50 to 80 foot wide. In youth it is quite pyramidal, then rounds out in maturity. The fall color tends to not be very spectacular, brown, red. Hardy from zones 3B to 9. Uh, there are a variety of pests and diseases that impact oaks, uh, but typically will not kill the tree. Likes moist, well-drained acidic soils, native to wet bottomlands. Avoid uh, disturbed sites and compacted soils when planting this tree. Here's a landscape tip. Majestic and worthwhile tree for large areas. Most important of the white oak group for commerce and wildlife.